across the country. Moving on, Chakan in Pune is well known as a hub for automobiles and manufacturing, but it now has a new feather in its cap. It's home to the world's largest manufacturing facility for biogas plants. On World Environment Day, CNBC TV 18's Jusilia K and Shilpa Rani Peta take you inside uh, social enterprise Sistema's Dot Bio's $1.5 million facility. This 1,30,000 square foot facility at Chakan in Pune makes prefabricated biogas plants. These plants can be installed by farmers on their farms and backyards to produce biogas using organic waste materials that are readily available on farms. The gas can then be used by farmers as cooking gas and to fuel various machines in and around the farm. This should result in both reduced pollution and lower fuel expenses. The Chakan facility is currently the largest of its kind in the world and boasts of a final capacity of 360 prefabricated biogas plants a day. Mexico-based Sistema Bio, which has set up this facility, says it wants to double capacity in a few years. So eventually we'd like to be able to produce over 300,000 per year. In the short term, we'll produce over 50,000 in 2023. And the maximum capacity for the plant that we've built today is about 100,000 units a year, which we hope to hit in 2024. Um, of that, about 80% will be installed in India and will be exporting about 20% over the next two years. And so the India manufacturing plant will allow us to reduce the price of our products in Eastern and Southern Africa and in other areas of South Asia and Southeast Asia. This facility will cater to the growing demand for biogas plants in both the Asia-Pacific region and Africa, and Sistema Bio hopes these plants will significantly reduce global greenhouse gas. To make the math easy, if we were to be installed in 50 million farms around the world, each reducing 10 tons of greenhouse gases every single year, that's about 1% of humanity's emissions, and that's the goal that we have between now and 2030. The company has demonstrated positive unit economics and turned profitable towards the end of 2021. This has helped it raise more funds and expand its global footprint. Now that we're a profitable entity and really demonstrating that this can work at scale, both scale of the impact and, and scale of the, the business, we're able to raise uh, funds that are dedicated for climate finance. And so our, our next big fundraising push will be on the order of about $100 million to support the uh, project development of new projects around the world, the largest of which is here in India. But we anticipate another 12 countries benefiting from uh, the, that project development. Funds alone, however, will not be enough. Sistema Bio says government policies that enable and encourage such green initiatives will be crucial if humanity has to make any headway in its fight against climate change and India's promises at various climate change conclaves like the COP27 are encouraging signs. In Mumbai with Jasilia K, Shilpa Rani Peta. All right, but that's a wrap. Don't go anywhere. News continues on CNBC TV 18.